What's up, guys? Back at it again. Back at it again. It's been a while. I know it. You know, we've been busy with all this other stuff we've been having to do. But, we're going to make this cara that is hot. <laughs> I'm going to throw my bacon in first. How much bacon is that? A um, whole package? A whole package of bacon. I already put some vegetable oil in the dish. The most, this is one of the best meals is this. Unhealthy as of course, but I feel it. When it's coming in, you gotta hide that, you know? gotta get fat. <laughs> and it feeds a lot of people. Yep. I mean, you can change it up. You can add shrimp if you want, or chicken. Or you can leave stuff out. Sometimes we put hot dogs in it. Just depends on what you want in it. Just what kind of mood you're in. We'll cook it up. The reason I like to throw in my bacon is I like to get all that bacon grease right there. Mm -hmm. Mix it up with the other stuff I got to throw in there and I'll get some good flavor going. Oh, looking good. Smelling good too, by the way. Pork chops in there. This is some vast pork chop. Through a whole package, so that's a lot. But, hey, it's all gonna get eaten anyway, so. Mm. Like that. I know I've been getting some requests to be cooking some more stuff, but like I said, guys, I've been extremely busy. You know, what was the last video I made that we took? Burgers, wasn't it? Yeah. Burgers and chicken. It's been a while, so hope this makes up for it. So we have the bacon and the chopped up pork chops. And then we got some chopped up ham that you use on your sandwiches, some chopped up steaks, and then we got two bell peppers chopped up, uh, one onion, and then we have some pork chorizo, some beef chorizo, and one pound of ground beef. Look at that. I'm just gonna need some more cooking going on. Look at that juicy meat. <laughs> so, the flavoring will come from these two things. Chorizo. Chorizo. Pero, but, we're just gonna add a little bit of some seasoned salt. <laughs> and some my lobo. Ooh. <laughs> That's okay. Now we're going to throw in some steaks. About this. I'll use that after the steak. Okay. Mix that up a little bit. Now we got to pour that to the side. I wish I had a bigger disc. Okay. I have to invest in a bigger one. So here we go. Let's do this. Might as well just throw in the ground beef. All that meat. This is definitely not a vegetarian meal. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
some chicken bouillon. And there's more flavor going on. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I like seasoned salt, so I'm gonna put some milk. You don't wanna put too much, cause you know, like I said, these things have already enough seasoning and flavor on it. You don't want it too salty. Suey's waiting. Waiting for a piece. <laughs> Add it in the tree, so. Go <laughs> buy That's a lot. Mix it up slowly. Slowly. And if it looks slow, you don't want it going everywhere. Look at that. I know some of these chunks are big, and we're gonna have enough time to cut it up. We've been running around today. But hey, still gonna get eaten. Make burritos, oh. make tacos. Oh, piece got away. So he's getting it. She says, I'm not gonna let it go to waste. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Give it some time to cook it up. So I'm gonna throw in that ham. Put some veggies on it, give it some color. I'm cooking some rice. Smells amazing. <laughs> cooking nice. some rice, and we bought some tortillas. So I mean, you could put this on rice or make a a burrito out of it. And I, you, know, you can add almost anything you want on this, you know, whatever you like. I just like it this way. Some pepper, some, you know. Just in a minute. Right. Look at that mess. Look at that mess. It's hand time. I'm going ham on this thing. This ham going. Probably should have cut up more ham. You mean you don't think we got enough meat on there? <laughs> Look at that. Ooh. You know, no one ever really taught me how to cook this. I just winged it. I said, just cut up some meat, put it together, and I watch a couple videos. Some people done it. You just got the idea from that. So this is our version. Yeah, <laughs> this is my version. See, so what do you think? Oh, oh. <laughs> there you go. Bell pepper. Add some color. Throw some veggies to make it kind of healthy. Yeah, real healthy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. After bell peppers and onions, I went ahead and added some green baby onions. I just love them, you know, so. Let them soak up some of that yeah. seasoning.
I'm the one cooking it. But. Like I said, I don't use measuring cups for my seasoning. It's just whatever you think it needs. Just go ahead and put it on. Do a taste test. And... Oh shit. Sorry. Excuse my French. Look at that. How does that look, guys? Ooh! Like burritos? And tacos? Tacos? Tacos, like the white people like to say. Like tacos, burritos, you know. Fuck, I even make tortas out of this, you know? Yeah, you can put it on a sandwich. Look at that. I will be doing another one, but this other one that I'm planning on doing, I will use nothing but game meat. Like, I got hog that we killed from Texas, deer. I was going to say, instead of ground beef, you can use ground deer. Or we're going we're gonna to do nothing but... Uh, throw some cubed up back straps in there. Or we're just going to do nothing but game meat, you know? Hell, I'll even throw squirrel in there if I have to. <laughs> What do you think, boys? Look good? What do you think, guys? I need your replies. I mean, like I said, I apologize for, you know, taking so so long to do another video. Been busy. You know, but, hi! We're doing one. So, <laughs> you know, hope you guys enjoyed. Hope you guys like it. Just post some pictures of our new plates later, watch. Gonna look like a bunch of fatties on here. Alright. Y'all have a good day, guys. Be safe. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Subscribe. Yeah, and subscribe. A lot of people like corn tortilla, like flour, but we need to cook that. That's still cold. Oops. Take two pieces. That's it.